What is going on people? Today we're going to be talking about the newly incorporated diamond shop that is in the game. Now, when you go and buy your packs now, you're going to be seeing the diamonds appear. Now, that's only going to happen if you actually have any diamonds already on your account. And you can do that and see that by going at the top here and you'll see how it shows my gems, but it also shows the diamonds that I currently have on the account. Now, when you have these diamonds, this is where you can actually just go ahead, click on a pack, and it'll buy it for you. And if you don't actually have enough diamonds to actually buy the pack, so for instance, if I go to like a $50 pack like this one, right? I only have $25 worth of uh, diamonds on the account. So if I go to the $50 and I click on it, what it's going to do is it's going to tell me that I have insufficient diamonds and it'll give me the option to use my Google Play. Now, from here, you can actually start using whether it's your PayPal or your Google Play balance if you have one, etc. And you can go about it the same way that you normally would before, whether it's through PayPal, etc. Uh, that's in case you don't have any diamonds. But keep this in mind because at the moment, uh, there actually is quite a bit of incentive to you to use these diamonds and if you take a look at your mail Everybody got this uh, information here game development team So here's what it says one day left to get bonus diamonds with your first purchase What are diamonds you may ask there are currency in Lords mobile that can be eight that can be used to purchase in-game packs and was just added in version 2.95 which is the last update essentially so Take a look at this, right? Here's how this is going to work. During the event, head to the diamond shop linked below to get 30% more diamonds with your first purchase. And that's actually quite interesting because the amount of diamonds that you can purchase is actually a bit different than the packs. They don't scale 5, 20, etc. You'll see what I mean in a bit, okay? So, it says, note, the number of diamonds you have will be displayed in the mall as long as you have at least one diamond, which is what I just showed you all the way at the top of the mall. And diamonds will be used first when purchasing in-game packs. You will be redirected to the regular payment menu if you have insufficient diamonds. So, like I mentioned, you'll use your diamonds first, and then once you use up your diamonds and you don't have enough, then it will it will redirect you to using either your Google Play or whatever it may be that you want to use. Now, let's actually go ahead and go over to the diamond shop because you got to take advantage of this while it's here. So, let's go ahead and click on that, and it'll redirect you over to the diamond store for IgG. And this is where you see here, first purchase bonus is 30%. Now that sounds pretty good already, but here's the kicker, right? You have a dollar purchase, two dollars, five dollars, ten dollars, and then look at this, twenty dollars, fifty dollars, one hundred dollars, and a five hundred dollars purchase option. So essentially, if your first purchase bonus is that five hundred dollars one, you're basically going to be getting six hundred and fifty dollars. That is pretty big, especially if you're a person that's planning to use that, whether it's throughout the month or the next couple of months, or you're just going to be getting a, the new hero that just came out, etc. That's a 30% bonus. And yes, even though it's only on your first purchase, the bigger your purchase, like for instance, even the $100 one or the $500 one, the, uh, the longer that 30% is actually going to be useful to you. And also remember, even if you get the $500 now, you don't necessarily have to spend it while this event is going on because the diamonds are going to stay on your account and you can continue to use those diamonds as packs uh, keep recycling and coming back, etc, etc. So... This is a great opportunity, especially if you're going to be getting runs of champions or whatever it may be, like the full amount. Uh, this would be a great way to get that 30% for at least the next couple. Um, another thing that also you should keep in mind is these monthly passes that they have. They have a monthly diamond pass, which is you buy one for the $20 or the, the uh, 2,000 uh, diamonds, and you get 70 every day for 30 days, and that'll basically net you 105 diamonds extra. So again, it's kind of like one of those things where you buy it up front, but you get more in, in the long term. And then the weekly diamond pass, same thing with that. 
Um, so it's kind of like investing your diamonds to get more diamonds, if you get what I'm saying. So that's that's pretty dang good. Um, and this is how these diamonds are going to work now. This is how it's going to be incorporated into the game. And you're, you're probably going to be seeing a lot more offers like this, like the 30%, etc. Because it is now incorporated straight into the game. Now right underneath here, it says about diamonds on the bottom right. So you can click on that and it'll give you more information on how this all works. So... Like we mentioned, what are diamonds is just going to be a, a, the currency that's going to be incorporated into the game. And it shows you here that once you have the diamonds, you can see it right at the top when you open up the mall. Now, it says here, um, diamonds can now be used to purchase packs on all platforms, whether that's Google, iOS, Steam, etc. So as long as you have the, the game updated to 2.95, you'll be able to use uh, the diamond shop in all the devices whether it's ios android uh, steam etc so it's kind of it's going to be like the universal currency that you're going to use to purchase your packs but like i said if you still want to use your google play points or whatever it may be uh that's still prompted if you are using uh or you're trying to buy a pack that's more than the diamonds that you currently have so um, this is going to be a great way for you to start saving up. If you don't use any of the other uh, ways that you can save some money, this is a great way for AGG to just incorporate it into the game. Um, now, yeah, with that being said, there is also another um, event that's going on that while this is all going on, you should probably take advantage of. And that is going to be this one right here, Buy to Win Amazing Rewards. And this is going to be uh, until, it looks like, until the end of today as well. So it says how to play. Purchase packs at the listed price tiers to earn points and unlock the respective rewards. So let's go ahead and join now. I've bought the $5 uh, Wave Crasher one right here. So it says one of one purchase. And so because I've already purchased a $5 pack, I can go ahead and claim this right now. So there it is. Congratulations. You won artifact coins, art arcade tomes chest of splendor and monstrous chest and so the more packs that i buy for the five dollar ones the more rewards are unlocked here and of course you see here that it, there is also a 20 dollar option there's a 50 dollar option and a hundred dollar option as well so depending on what it is that you're going to get you can continue to buy these packs and these are basically just extra rewards that you can get so take advantage of the diamond store you have the 30 percent that's going on right now and you have these extra incentives that when you buy the packs, you get these extra uh, prices here. So this will be the great way to do it. Um, if you're still wondering how this is all going to work, for instance, how you use the diamonds, I'll go ahead and buy one of the, um, the weekly or the monthly one. That way you can see how it all goes. So let's take a look at the weekly pass. So let's do, let's do the weekly artifact pass. So the way that this will do is this will use $20 of my diamonds. So essentially 2000 of my diamonds. And I'm going to get 800 um, artifact coins right away. And then the daily rewards will be 400 for the week every uh, every day. And eventually it'll come down to 3600 So all you got to do with diamonds, once you load up your diamonds on your account, etc. You just click. That's right. And that's it. There it is. Items purchased. Now I can go ahead and collect. And there it is. Six days remaining. I can go ahead and keep this going. And now if you take a look here, when you go up, you'll see that I had 2,500 diamonds. Now I only have 538 diamonds. And from there, I can get maybe another, another, one, of these, uh, another one of these packs. And you know what? Let's, let's get the Astrolite chest, right? Because we're, we're probably going to start working on Astrolite. Let's get the Astrolite chest. That's going to do 499 diamonds. The full charge gift is mine, which is nice. And then take a look at this. Now I am down to 39 diamonds. So now if I go and try to buy any other one, you're going to get the, the same pop-ups as before. Like you'd need more diamonds and boom, it'll prompt you into either your PayPal, your Google Play balance, etc. So uh, yeah, um, hopefully this was helpful. Let me know what you guys think so far of the diamond store. We'll be interested to see what you guys think so far. Uh, and also, if you have any questions, leave them down in the comment section and maybe I or anybody that can read it will help you out if you have any issues as well. Um, but yeah, appreciate you guys for coming through and until later.